The Chancellor George Osborne visited Hartlepool today to congratulate workers at a firm which has won a multi-million pound contract. The contract places Herima Fabrication at the centre of an international gas project in the North Sea, securing work at the site for years to come. Well, our Teesside correspondent Rachel Bullock joins us live now. Rachel, a hugely important day for Hartlepool. Yes, indeed, the Cygnus project is a £1.4 billion development to expand the sixth largest gas field in the North Sea. And Cygnus has chosen Herima to build the platforms in order to carry out that work. In effect, this Hartlepool site is spearheading the UK's involvement in this multi-million pound project. It'll create 400 jobs here, but thousands more right across the rest of the UK. That's why the Chancellor made a personal visit here today. That's why Herima is celebrating the biggest deal in its history. The moment the Chancellor switched on a deal between this Hartlepool site and one of the world's biggest deep sea gas developments. The Cygnus field off the coast of Lincolnshire has potential gas reserves of 18 billion cubic metres. But to get to it, these are needed giant platforms to drill deep into the North Sea bed and extract gas to meet the demands of one and a half million homes. Herima will build four top sides for the platforms, guaranteeing three years of work both here and far beyond. It is, I think, exactly what we want to see in the North East, which is the government helping the creation of private sector jobs that last for the long term, instead of just borrowing more and more money and making our problems as an economy even greater. It's a very large award, probably uh, a record for this, uh, for this yard and its history. Crucial for the continuation of, uh, of labor here in this area, not only in this yard, but also in the area drawing all through the supply chain uh, through 2015. The Harima Group is a world leader in the gas and oil industry. It has sites across the globe, however, just five of them fabricate its offshore platforms. Three are at home in Holland, the fourth is in Poland, and the fifth, Hartlepool. And it's not hard to see why Herima Hartlepool was chosen for this multi-million pound contract. The Dutch firm describes its Hartlepool base as a prime location, offering ready access to the North Sea by road, rail and air, and nestled between Tyneside and Teesside, two of the gas industry's major sources for skills and expertise. The basic skill sets required to manufacture and build these things uh, are on the doorstep. And this is just testament to those that work in this industry. Construction work will begin in December for completion in 2015, but the economic benefits they'll generate for the North East are expected to last far longer. Rachel Bullock, Hartlepool.